am Zabarak. My life has been long, and throughout it I have lived by one maxim. Liberty or death. Frenesque was the perfect world. Harsh, but fair. Survival forced my people to become the greatest of warriors. When the stranger promised us conquest and plenty, we followed him. It was a mistake. On Gilinor, I built a mighty empire in the name of the Dark God Zaros. But he and I did not share the same vision for the future. When I saw freedom, he saw only control. My people, once warriors, became priests, bureaucrats, sanitation engineers. To win their freedom, I struck down a god. To safeguard it, I became one. On Infernus, I led a downtrodden people to victory. Hostilius, a corpulent monster grown fat and indolent, maintained order through rules and laws. His laws did as little to protect him as his skin did. I strung up his corpse as a message for all to see. Such is the fate of all tyrants. The Avernic demons, now free, serve me willingly. Back on Gilinor, pretenders picked over the remains of my empire. For an age I battled them. An age of strife, of progress, of glory. While I fought on, none could establish the safety, the security that they so craved. For an age, Gilinor was truly free. But they conspired against me. And I was banished. In my long absence, this world has become weak. Saradoman's fingers are wrapped tightly around its throat, suffocating it. My demon army will make short work of its farmers, woodcutters, and fishermen. The survivors will be stronger. They will have no choice. Gilinor's people will be free, or they will die. Liberty or death. <laughs>